the good news for Carol is that Charlie can't find out what the weather in the Himalayas <laughs> is. No, I've got the Himalayan weather, and it's uh, uh, varying between, I was saying, minus 16 in some parts, <laughs> with snow, which is cold, so you're not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> um, Carol, so let's talk a little bit about, um, you've, you've presented some extraordinary places. We've got pictures, lovely pictures, I think, of you presenting in virtually a blizzard. Yes, it was Remind us when this was. This was quite a long time ago, around about 2002-ish. <laughs> and the snow was coming oh. down. We could see the blizzard coming, we knew it was on the way, but still, I had to present in it. And um, it was really painful, actually, because as the snow hits your face, it's mm. like pins and needles. And in another one, I had an umbrella, and mm -hmm. it was... Um, Rather unfortunately, that was at Balmoral Castle. I did another one actually on the Glenshane Pass in Northern Ireland, which was even worse than the one in... So that was Balmoral Castle. Did you have yes. to stay the night? <laughs> uh, the Queen wasn't there, sadly, so she couldn't invite me. But <laughs> what a shame. <laughs> I think we've got another clip here. What are we going to see now? Uh, we've got Bill, I think Bill presenting, Bill, Bill presented, trying to present the weather. Bill was brilliant at presenting the weather. He has a real natural flair for it. You know, he did do a bit of a pirouette in the middle, which of course okay. we don't do. Okay, but let's see. He was very good. Let's have a look. Well, as Carol would say, it's absolutely gorgeous here in sunny Cornwall. So, lots of lovely sun here, but I can see problems elsewhere. You see, we're going to have a bit of a, a warm front here and a cold front here, and that's going to create an occlusion. Not in total seclusion, but it might cause some confusion and possibly contusions. Suffering from delusions? I am. It should say seasonably warm and sunny, except in Scotland where there'll be lots of snoo. <laughs> but later, it could get a bit chilly, so remember, long-term outlook, wrap up warm. Is <laughs> I the only one who's mesmerised by Bill's trousers? <laughs> I was looking at his hair. He looks so young. We weren't listening to the weather. No, That's part of the problem, oh, isn't no, it? We need it back. But Billy was brilliant. He, was he? he? Yes, he was. His weather forecast was actually rubbish, but his <laughs> presentation was really, really good. Uh, talk to us about the presentation thing, because, I mean, the, the personality of the weather presenter is sparing your blushes, you know? I mean, you, you are much loved. The nation warms, don't they, if you'll excuse the weather pun. <laughs> The weather presenters, <laughs> and we kind of we get to know you a bit. And, and over the years, I mean, first female presenters for the weather didn't have a terribly easy time with it, did they? Barbara Edwards was the very first weather presenter, female weather presenter, and she, I believe, had a tough time with her choice of wardrobe. And mm. I know that she got a bit fed up with people criticising what she wore, but she always did look lovely. We've seen some pictures of her mm. this morning. Yes, and I love the sort of, you know, you all have different words as well, which we like to hear. Scorchio! Yes, Scorchio yeah. is one of my favourites. Uh, Drich as well as one Drich. of yours, isn't it? Yes, well. that's a good Scottish word, that <laughs> one. Did you always want to be a weather girl? No, I didn't. I fell into it by accident, and when I did, I fell completely and totally in love with what it. What was the accident? What happened? I was going, well, this is a long story, I'll cut it short. I was going, <laughs> <laughs> we're just settling, now we're just yeah, really a cup of tea. Um, basically, I had an agent who was very hungry. He was brand new. He mm -hmm. sent me for an audition with the Weather Channel, and I went along thinking, I don't want to be a weather presenter. Went to um, other studios with a competitor, and just loved it. You know, there's nothing behind us usually when we present. It's just what we call chroma key or CSO. Mm -hmm. So when you run your finger down a weather front when there's nothing behind you, it's just like they're feeling like, yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> and what amazes me, because, you know, we, we have a little bit of help here, Charlie, don't we? We have things like scripts and mm. auto cue and stuff like that. Um, and, you, you know, you're there for three minutes, you've got your maps. Sometimes you don't even have the maps and you can remember, every, you remember it. A lot of that, Lou, is because you understand the subject. And we've had lots of discussions about it in the morning. I'm in a conference with the Met Office, with the chief forecasters who are studying the weather. And we have big discussions what about What time are you having this call? Five past five. Five past five, okay. But there are various discussions discussions through the course of the day. Yeah. We've got all the observations as well, radars, um, temperatures, wind speeds and so on and so forth. Mm -hmm. And um, it's pretty pretty good. And you have people planning their lives, don't they, around the world. So yeah. today, for example, there are people weddings tomorrow, you know, they're thinking, what's Carol going to say? It's going to be That's nice for our wedding day. Yes, it is. If you're getting married tomorrow, gorgeous. <laughs> Sparkling, lovely. A few wintry showers in Scotland, but apart from that, not of us will see them. Gorgeous. Oh, it's really lovely. It's lovely to see you here as well, Carol. Thank lovely you very much. Lovely to be here. Thank you. Uh, and just a reminder, for a celebration of 60 years of BBC TV weather, you can go to the BBC website, bbc.co.uk slash history of the BBC. One, one more thing, one more thing. Um, you're doing a Facebook chat, are you? That's right, yes. That people are sending questions. Yeah, any questions weather-related, feel free to ask. Weather-related. <laughs> Thank you very much, Carol. <laughs>
Surely, just weather. Okay? Yeah, just weather. OK, I get it. I get it. Uh, Jedward are going to be here in a moment. That'll be chaotic. I hear them already. Uh, first and last, quick look what's happening where you are. We'll see you in a minute. Good morning.